Hello all and welcome to Magus Craig Gaming. Alright, today, <gasps> excuse me, we are playing Medieval Dynasty and this is the first village I've ever built. First data, well maybe not first data, well it is the first data that I've actually kept from way back in bed and all that. So I have had to um, start, I started well, this is not my very first data, but this is the first official data that once the game was completed, I could continue without having any type of issues with the um, the quest lines. And as you can see, this is a little tour of my town. It's right here off on the, uh, what is it, the, the east side, northeast side of Gustavia while we're over here. It looks like I'm burdened with something. I don't know. Maybe I have manure. I'm going to have to check that out. And we've got lots of eggs here. Let's get some of these eggs picked up. Uh, I'm going to hit P so I can see this better. Now, if you set a person to this hut, you will get uh, a lot more uh, in materials from here because you can set how much you get per day of what and what um, instead of just getting uh, randomized from here. But that's okay. Look at all my chickens. <coughs> I'm wondering if I should sell some. Let's see, it's spring. Let's go to management. Let's go to animals. We've got 10 chickens. These three I'm going to keep. I think I'm going to build another one and transfer these three. And maybe. Maybe two more. This hen one I'm going to sell, I think. I only need three, so this one I'm gonna sell. I can sell that for 600. I'm gonna sell it for 600. These three I'm gonna keep. Maybe even uh, one of these, but uh, these are hens already. Okay, so, and I've got five pigs. I should have more than that. I thought I built a second stall. Um, did I, let me look at, it's only showing one pig sty. Did I not save my data for this morning? Let me look here. Let's load. No, it says 446 and that was before I went to work, so. Hmm. Okay, that's interesting. Alright, let's go ahead and get a drink and all that kind of jazz and figure out what we're going to do with this inventory, what we've got that's burning me. Animal feed. What happened here? I bought some animal feed and didn't even know about it. Oh, I bought that just before the end, I thought, and I thought I put all of it in there. Maybe I bought some extra? That's where I put all my in. I did buy some extra. Okay. Alright, that's in there. And I do have manure. Alright, let's get on our donkey. We're going to get some more manure, as you can see. We're going to make a pass on all the pigsties and everything and get our manure and stuff. Leave the donkey right here. <coughs> It's odd that he puts manure over on this side when I always park him on the other side, but uh, whatever. It works. Alright, let's see our pigs here. Uh, we had two piglets over here in this one, but they may have been grown up now, I don't know. Let's see what we're getting here. Not a lot of manure from them, so uh, we'll leave that. 
Here's my other one next to the orchards. I did gather, there's a piglet. I did gather manure a long time ago. So, or not a long time ago this morning. <coughs> I'm surprised Morris is not there. All right, I need some water. Let's go down to the well. I'm losing health. Get a drink real quick. Let's see if there's anything we can cook. Oh, I've got 30 fish now. That's pretty cool. I'm starting to get fish. My fisherman's actually working, so my fisherman is working. That's really cool for me. I like it. The fish is a little more weight. It looks like it's worth weight. It's worth more in money. That's for sure. Well, now that we have that, let's look in here. This is where I normally cook everything until I can get a kitchen. Let's look here for a fish dish. These are all meat dishes. Um, do we have a fish dish? <coughs> there is no fish dishes. Well, that's kind of crappy. Hmm. Well, let's go to M real quick. We'll go to management. We'll go here and we'll go to the hunting, the fishing hut. And we're going to set some stuff up here. Let's see here. We're getting about 40 of those a day and I have about 30. Let's drop this to 35 and we'll put this up a bunch. Oh, uh, let's keep dropping that. Since we can't do anything besides cook it, I think. I think I can cook it or dry it, I'm not sure. I'm going to see if I can cook it. Actually, there might be... We'll leave it right there for a second. Let's go ahead and grab some of that. We'll grab 10 of it. Let's see. I think we can cook this still. I think there is a way to cook this. And I think it's on just the camp, not in the bowl right here on a pike salted so uh, fresh meats right here okay so let's see what this does let's see what roasted does anyways <coughs> I need some food anyways so we'll cook this and see how much it's worth Alright, so that's what you can do with the fish. Let's see what the roasted fish is worth. Six? Okay. And it does how much? Oh, it does quite a bit. I think it does eight. That's uh, better than... Uh, that's actually better than um, the raw... Or the roasted meat. So fish is definitely a better filler than um, hunting meat is. <coughs> Let's get off this guy real quick. We're in the end of the second day of spring. Let's see here. We'll leave that going up. Um, dried meats. We're going to take uh, 30, 41. Oop, I messed it up. Let's just take one more. We'll leave 35. The fresh eggs. We're going to go ahead and cook those eventually. So let's look real quick what we can cook. I think I need a bowl to cook those. Uh, let's look here. So I need a bowl and three eggs or a bowl and three eggs. Uh, that gets some mushrooms. Too bad I couldn't cook them in a plate. 
Hmm. I do have some bowls. So, let's grab some eggs. I do have some eggs already, but we're, I've got some extra bowls right now. And I don't have hardly any cabbage or meat to cook. So, we'll take the eggs. That'll be something to make some money with right now in this period of time. Since I'm out of cabbage, I sold it all in my... People ate everything, so let's go here. Let's see. Yeah, we'll go here. We'll do 21 of these. I think that'll be good. A little cooking lesson here. <clears throat> now you can craft bowls and plates out of logs at a workshop, um, or you can buy them. I'll show you real quick here. You can buy them right here from one of the clay and woodworkers clay pot makers and woodworkers you can buy both there plates and uh let's see what that food's worth 60 wow that is worth a lot that's more that's worth more than pottage uh we're gonna go sell that Eggs are really nice, even though I only get them in little bits. Maybe I will produce a second uh, chicken stall here real soon. Let's go ahead and go a little faster. I do have some farms that are going to be over there. I'm working on them currently. I'm going to put another barn and another farm shed over there and have some workers over there and also some houses. And uh, put some new workers over on that side for farming. Or move some old workers over there for farming. I probably could keep one farm shed and one barn for now. Um, and let them walk a distance. Uh, it wouldn't be too hard to let them walk a distance. But, uh, you know, it may be hoove me to actually... Um, let's talk to her real quick and sell. <clears throat> Let's come here. We're going to sell all the dried meats. That's $230. we will sell the remainder of the cabbage. And we'll sell these. That's 1000 for 20 of those. Woo! We just made bank. Now we got 10,000 gold, uh, silver, 10,000 coin, whatever you want to call it. So we're doing pretty good here. Ooh, I almost ran into that really hard. I'm glad I didn't. <clears throat> oh, look, I can have my torch on. <laughs> That's funny. <coughs> now, typically I wouldn't be on, but I took a... I guess you could say a mental health day, basically in all terms and necessary things, it is a mental health day. So, I do suffer from uh, quite a bit of things. And one in particular is bipolar manic depression, and uh, along with PTSD and a few other things. So, if you have mental health issues, uh, do take care of yourself because it is uh, it's your life. Take care of your life. Let's go ahead and search this real quick one more time. I've got 20 fish now. It should start making dried fish, but it is the end of the day, so there's nothing going to be produced anymore. I've got some manure. So real quick, we're going to go make this manure into fertilizer. And uh, particularly, I have a lot of fertilizer, which is good, because I'm going to need it. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and get off right here. Let's go ahead and make this real quick. 45 units. I'll take that all day long. I think I can get one more unit here, because I think I have an extra manure in this uh, barn here. <clears throat> Let's look. One extra manure, and we'll place all the fertilizer in there. Let's make one more. Oh, 
All right, what do we have? Quite a bit of manure. We can't put any in. All right, we've got quite a bit there. We're gonna have to move this donkey. <clears throat> time to put him away and go to bed everybody's zoning for the last end of the day the farmer down here is talking to someone here let's see what we got we've got plenty of room in here so let's go ahead and throw that in there <clears throat> and you know what while we're at it we're gonna pick up another 50 kilos out of here uh, let's see 50 we'll take that and reason being is is I think I can fill up this farm shed and get some more stuff planted hopefully soon let's make sure this is filled up we can put another uh, 15 or 18 in about 18 in we'll do 17 ish let's see what 17 ish is uh, we'll go 17. I think that's uh, good enough. I probably could go 1750, but let's see what we got here. <clears throat> nope, I wouldn't have been able to. So we've got 248 in there. Oat grains up. Carrot seeds good. Cabbage we need some. Got nine bags, ten simple bags, some decent rye gain. Some decent onions, decent flaxseed, some decent tools. I'm going to need some more stone hoes. Let's go ahead and put some more uh, fertilized back. I've got four logs <clears throat> on this tomb. take this guy right over here and put him in this little spot I should name him time to go take a shower night watchman oh not a shower a bath I can't take a shower in this game <clears throat> do a quick save donkey is making some noise let's see is the boy up let's see the wife oh I hit the wrong button I hit four some of the buildings are damaged okay all right since so she said that we're gonna look real quick and see what's damaged because I could have swore I fixed everything. Sewing hut. I didn't fix that. It's at 59. We'll fix that in the morning time. <clears throat> Let's talk to her one more time. How is life treating you? Time for taxes has come. Oh, I forgot about taxes. Actually, let's have her do those. Um, I have a favor to ask you. Boom. Okay, 3,621 coins. Holy cow. Taxes was a lot. But taxes are paid. Now, we're going to go ahead and save 5,000 coins. We're going to stack this so we can actually do things like buy animals and stuff like that every season I'm gonna stack 5k if I can Gotta put one more penny in. He always does that. I think it's bugged. Okay, so we're doing pretty good here. 1800 to work with after taxes are paid and uh, a stash is put away. 
ten thousand bucks all right let's see let's go ahead and quick save and also hard save and uh, I think uh, we'll keep it at about 20 minutes that's my village and uh, there will be more of this alright like subscribe and follow and comment below thank you